John, halfway through MBAA 2019, a lot of interesting things going on. And of course, the thing that's kind of interesting about the aviation industry is so much of it now in terms of training and education comes to us via simulation. But painting airplanes, painting anything via simulation, tell me what this is all about. Well, it works just as well with painting aircraft, um, painting virtual reality. It, uh, it really helps with the training aspect. Um, and rather than using actual paint and trying to paint an airplane and mess it up, you can actually practice on this first. If you have any issues on the aircraft, then you'd have to go back and strip it and repaint it, and so which takes time and money. And so with this, you don't have to worry about that. Now, does this apply to different kinds of structures, different kinds of paints, different kinds of techniques and application equipment? Oh yes, we can change from the viscosity to the paint, the air pressure of the guns. We can change to whatever you're getting ready to paint. How do you teach somebody to use this in order to get properly trained? Well, usually there's a couple of us, one that runs the computer and one that actually helps out with putting the VR unit on first. And then we run you through the do's and the don'ts. From there, we give you a little bit of training first before you go and spray the part. And then we just let them go from there. Well, show me how this thing works. Grab the gun. So I'm going to walk over here to this part. So the laser, you're looking at the laser, the laser is red. It's telling me that you're too far away from the part. Okay. So you would get closer and you'd get the laser to, to go to the color green. Gotcha. And that's optimum distance. Blue is too close. Okay. All right. So then your objective is to paint this entire part on top of the edges, the bottom of the edges, inside, outer edges. And then that's how you get your scores. So then what you can do after you've done that, as you go back and look at the board, you unlock it, and goes to finish. And then so it shows me blue is on light and green is where you want to be for your optimum mill thickness range. Okay. So John, this is being deployed now. You say you're doing classes, uh, what was it, four times a year? Four times a year in the U.S. and then we do four in Europe and then we're going to be doing four in Asia. And what's the response been from your students? Great. Great. So actually, we um, right now we have 20 students per class, 18 to 20, and we have a waiting list. So yeah, it's 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 going really well. Very cool, John. Thanks so much for spending time with Aero TV and Airborne. Thank you. Yes, sir. Aero TV is brought to you by. Now, the MD-302 Standby Attitude Module, SAM, is even smarter. Introducing the MD-32 Magnetometer, designed specifically for SAM. This optional magnetometer delivers independent heading reference. Its unique mounting flexibility, compact size, and convenient cockpit calibration ensures an easy, low-cost installation every time. Available from your local avionics dealer. There's never been a better time to become a pilot. At the Sling Pilot Academy, you can get your private, commercial, and instrument ratings in nine months for less than $63,000 and do it in modern, fun airplanes. Your flight training is going to be as exciting as your future career as an airline pilot. SlingPilotAcademy.com